what's going on guys in this video i'm going to show you guys how to make a stand out of pvc pipe you can use this to store your hard work and your awesome cosplays on and it also works great as a painting station i built three uh different sizes so i'm not going to give you any measurements but i am going to give you guys a rough parts list and the reason why i say rough is because you can just make it however you want to i'm just going to show you guys how i made mine uh, there's so many different configurations you can do, and you can do a lot with PVC pipes. And it's very cheap too. So, uh, yeah, check it out. I got four 90 degree elbows, about seven of these. Buy them by the package, cheaper. And everything is for one inch PVC pipe. You're gonna need some glue and some PVC cutters. Cutting a couple of one inch nipple pieces. This is gonna connect those two pieces. And this is gonna be your cross member. You can Make it to fit whatever size you want. I decided to make mine about a foot long. And once you get it all together, this will form your base of your PVC stand. Before you glue everything together, you want to make sure everything is nice and straight. I didn't do that and I ended up with a lopsided stand. But it's an easy fix. You just take your heat gun, soften up the glue again, and then use another pipe to straighten it back out. Now that I've got everything nice and straight, I'm going to glue all the pieces together. Right here is another cross member. This is going to go about waist height of my stand. And this is the shoulder cross member, which is going to go on the very top. Notice I put a T in the center. This is going to act as the post for my head. I'm going to go ahead and glue the rest of the sides together and assemble the whole entire thing. Now you have this funky looking ladder kind of thingy call it whatever you want. I'm going to put the head rack and the arm pieces together. I'm not going to glue them down so I can move it around if I need to. And here's a shot of my Batman mecha suit on there. I prefer to use the smaller stand so I can store it away. I can put it in my closet or tuck it behind somewhere in out of sight, out of mind. And it makes it easier to transport it from home to convention or wherever you're going to take it because it's not as tall. Once you get it all on there, it looks like this munchkin Batman mecha. This PVC stand mannequin or whatever you want to call it really helps out because I can actually consolidate all my cosplays into one little kit and then put it aside and it won't be in the way because I actually have like 15 cosplays. Like, really. And uh, today's shout outs goes to Family First J. He's been a subscriber of mine since the beginning, since before I even did cosplay. I wanted to give him a shout out. And then I uh, also want to give a shout out to Michael G. He's been very active on my channel. And then I want to give a YouTube shout out to Kareem Shahan. He asked for this video, like, as I was working on it. So, we like on the same wavelength, buddy. Um, this is not a mannequin, but it's kind of close. I think you can make it into a mannequin, however you configure it. Hey, thanks for watching. Like the video if you like it. Share with somebody who cares. Um, follow me on Instagram. Like me on Facebook. And hit the subscribe button if you ain't already subscribed. I'll talk to y'all later.